What's up, people? I'm Charles. And I'm Jared. And together, we're Team Rocket. <laughs> yeah, sorry, Charlotte. That means that you're Meow. Anyways, guys, welcome back. We're about to jump into a video which is gonna blow your mind. That's what it looks like. But first, let me just remind you, make sure to hang around to the end of the video so that we can respond to your comments. It's gonna be wild. Like, wild as in, you know, Let's do it. You also gotta send us fan mail. Even though we read your comments, we would love to get some fan mail, anything you guys could write for us. I, I mean, I know Charlotte got a picture of herself one time, which is really cool. I would like a picture. Wink, wink. Well, why don't we get pictures? I know, like, what, what, what's so good about Charlotte, guys? But you, all you gotta do is send it to our PO box. It'll be in the description down below. We're also gonna post it right here. All you gotta do is send it to that address. We'll get it, and we'll actually reply on camera. So it's not like, you know, we're not going to. So science is dope, right? Obviously, and a human body too. That's pretty lit. Well, some sciencey people who know a whole lot about the human body have published new research, which in fact classifies an entirely new organ within a human body. What is this organ? It's the mesentery, or at least that's how we think you say it because again, it's new. What does it do? We have no idea. We know it's there though, so that's something, right? We also know where it's located, and that is within the digestive system. The organ is composed of a double lining of peritoneum, and it attaches the stomach, small intestine, pancreas, spleen, and other organs to the back wall of the abdomen. What's that you just said? You didn't study a PhD in medicine. You have no idea what the peritoneum is. Well, that's the membrane which encloses all of the organs within the abdomen. So basically, the mesentery is keeping everything in place for us. How nice of it, right? For hundreds of years, this section of the body has been overlooked because it was considered to be made up of multiple separate parts. But the review published in November issue of the journal, The Lancet Gastroenterology and the Heptology, outlined some strong evidence for categorizing the parts as one organ. With the lead author, Professor John Coffey, stating, I quote, The anatomic description that has been laid down over a hundred years of anatomy was incorrect. This organ is far from fragmented and complex. It is simply one continuous structure, end quote. The next step in this process, now that the organ has been identified, is to find out what its function is. Once we've done that, we can identify abnormal function and from that stems disease. This is actually very exciting. Like, it could be a giant leap forward in how we treat various ailments and disease and perform surgeries for years to come. So exciting, in fact, that widely used medical books Grey's Anatomy has already been updated and released to include the mesentery as an organ, which means all future doctors will learn about it as a separate organ. Super stoked. So how do you guys feel now you know you have an extra organ inside of you? And have you ever had an extra organ inside of you before? I'm so excited, man. I'm so excited. And I just can't hide it. If so, let us know in the comments below. And on that note, we gotta respond to some of your comments. First up, Christina Goobler said, Charles is the worst host. He speaks to Slow down for a second. And mixed with his terrible... Uh, you know what? F*** you, Christina Goobler. No one cares what you have to say. Next comment. Goobler! <laughs> USA and Russia should form alliance with each other. We be good. <laughs> <laughs> and that was from Face Pepper. I agree, I think. I don't really right, know what you said. That's a great comment. Next up, Flux said, bring back Bun Guy. Here he is. Oh, he did it! Oh, shit, I didn't even notice. Yeah, man. Bun Guy said, just for but you, this, Flux. This little piece of hair keeps coming out and I hate it. I, I, I tuck it behind my ear, otherwise I'm gonna do the whole video like this and it yeah. just looks dumb. Do it. There you go. Don't say we don't ever do things for you, Flux. This is you. No more bun! <laughs> Overkill XD said, I know right away from the bottom of the most important thing is that in the beginning. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> I know right away from the bottom of the most important thing is that in the beginning. I know right away from the bottom of the most important thing. <laughs> Has anyone even been as far as to really even want to do You know what? Like that was harder than me trying to smell the color nine. Anyway, guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed. Yeah, guys, uh, again, check out our PO box in the description. We're going to leave it right down below here on a little screen. And Flux, Bun Guy was back, but now he's back to just looking like Jesus, apparently. 